dancing when I was eight years old. I was always dancing, uh, moving, I was doing sports, uh, I was outdoors um, during the summertime in Spain, it's really warm inside, so you always go outdoors. So I was always playing. Um, the first time I would dance, the memory of the first time I dance, I think um, at home it was just, just dancing. Every time I you know, listen to some music, I would be drawn to dance. So just as a child, yeah. my journey has been um, kind of like a bit of everything. Um, I started with ballet, just doing the exams, and then at the age of 21, I started doing contemporary, and I continue with both ballet and contemporary. Um, as I got older. I just start drawing more towards contemporary dance, more creative kind of a dance and um, I study two masters in dance and um, choreography and um, I worked teaching dance to different people, theatre people, old people, um, people with disability, ballet dancers, professional dancers any age so yeah choreographing my own work and uh, so it's been um, a very creative journey until now uh, what um, advice to the young dancer of today I would say go to every workshop that you can because you will always learn something uh, go to see shows go to see art in general it uh, doesn't need to be dance uh, it could be visual arts um, it could be performance art um, film um, yeah poetry um, festivals uh, anything it can inspire you to your dance um, so i would recommend just be curious about um, things around you and i would advise um, yeah, think about um, and every day it's um, you always learn something new and um, mainly enjoy the journey of dancing and yeah I would say definitely enjoy the dancing the journey thank you <laughs>